Jennifer Aniston throws star-studded 50th birthday celebration, and even her ex Brad Pitt sneaks into the party. They remained friends throughout his ill-fated relationship with Angelina Jolie, and eagle-eyed onlookers spotted Brad Pitt, 55, sneaking past the paparazzi as he joined the star's ex-wife Jennifer Aniston's 50th birthday party in Los Angeles on Saturday night. The actor, who's been quietly dating Charlize Theron since January, kept a flat cap firmly over his head as he rushed inside Jennifer's favorite West Hollywood spot, the historic Sunset Tower. He wasn't alone, with stars including Katy Perry and boyfriend Orlando Bloom, chat show host Helen DeGeneres, Gwyneth Paltrow, Barbara Streisand, Jason Bateman and Kate Hudson joining the celebrations. Jennifer's actual birthday is still two days away but she was still game to arrange a soiree. Jennifer showed up to her own party as a stylish all-black jumpsuit with crisscrossing string backing. She and Brad divorced in 2005, though they've managed to keep up a cordial relationship in the years since. The two began dating after meeting on a blind date their respective agents set up in 1998. They quickly became the id couple of the early 2000s, with their every move making headlines. Two years after they met, Aniston and Pitt married. Their marriage ended on January 5, 2005. The couple announced that they had formally separated. It soon emerged that he had begun a relationship with Angelina Jolie, with the actress later confirming years later that they fell in love while filming Mr. and Mrs. Smith in 2003, while he was still married to Jennifer. Throughout his 11-year relationship with Angelina, tabloid stories regularly emerged that Brad was still in contact with Jennifer seeking advice from his former wife despite his new love's objections. And it seems that following Brangelina's nasty divorce, Brad may well have renewed his friendship with his ex. On Saturday, the exes had plenty of mutual friends to celebrate with. Katie and Orlando showed off their need for speed as they arrived at Jen's party on his grey Husqvarna motorcycle. Orlando wore jeans and a blue fleece-lined jacket while Katie fittingly rocked a pair of shiny vinyl pants and an edgy leather biker's jacket. Funny woman Ellen the Generous was also spotted joining the birthday shindig. During the Dumplin' Star's appearance on The Ellen Show, the host promised a special hour-long appearance for her friend on the occasion of her 50th birthday, but that didn't stop her from celebrating a bit early. Iron Man and Avengers co-star Robert Downey Jr. showed up to Jennifer Shindig looking every bit like Tony Stark. The acclaimed actor made one of the toasts during Jennifer's ill-fated wedding to Justin Theroux, which ended with their separation in late 2017. Jason Bateman, her co-star in 2010's The Switch, stepped out of a car with a goatee, a rarity for the usually clean-shaven actor. Kate Hudson stopped by the birthday party in a shining black dress. The How to Lose a Guy and 10 Days actress recently appeared with Jennifer in the romantic comedy Mother's Day. There was also plenty of Hollywood royalty at the Marley and Me Stars Bash. Barbara Streisand and her husband James Brolin made an appearance. Diane Keaton arrived in her trademark fingerless gloves and wide-brimmed black hat. A smiling David Arquette a figure from Jennifer's Friends days, made a special appearance. After he married her co-star Courtney Cox, the NBC sitcom's cast famously appended Arquette to all of their names to poke, loving, fun at their colleague. Jennifer Meyer, who designed the Horrible Bosses star's wedding ring from her marriage to Justin Theroux, dropped by the party as well.